welcome back to my channel so over on pinterest i saw these cute little um charcuteries i believe is what they're called it's basically a charcuterie board shoved into a mini mason jar and they are called charcuteries and they are so cute so i'm going to be making those today and showing you guys how i do them um we are having a bachelor night over at one of my friends's house and so i'm going to make up a couple of these to take with me they're perfect for nights like tonight or you can make them for parties whatever you like and they're so cute so kind of a newer twist on the charcuterie board and i love them so i'm gonna go ahead i'm gonna flip you guys around and i'm gonna show you how i make them okay so these are the little mason jars they are jam jars i believe um they make like little pint jars i like that these were a little bit taller they're kind of hard to see um but I love these. You can get a four pack at Walmart, which is what I did, um, or they have them on Amazon. So I will leave some link down below, but this is what I'm gonna be using. Okay, so here is everything that I'm pretty much using. Um, I just have some of these toasted chips, some pretzel rods that I snapped in half, some grapes that I put on some skewers, pickles on skewers, the tomato and mozzarella on skewers. The skewers will just help them stand up in the jar and be prettier. And then some chocolate chips, some extra tomatoes, some rosemary. I love these. They're just so pretty. Um, some trail mix. And then this is cream cheese that I've balled up. And I rolled this one in bacon bits and this one in kind of just like a seasoning blend that I made. If you have everything but the bagel seasoning, that would be perfect and so delicious. So kind of do it how you want, but this is the base of what I'm using. these turned out I think that they are so cute this is perfect for any party event that you're going to um, I love the ball of cheese I was gonna leave my cheese kind of pre-wrapped I'm so glad that I didn't um, just stick these in the freezer that way they don't get really soggy and soft super fast um, but overall these are super cute I love them so let me know what you guys think as well if you want to see more of these I think like a candy jar would be so pretty uh, maybe for like a little girl's birthday I don't know just some ideas in my head but these are perfect for your next party. Thank you guys for watching today's video. I hope that you enjoyed it. I love these and I hope that you guys love them as well. Let me know if you decide to make them at home. Share your pictures with me over on Instagram. I would love to see. And as always, if you are new around here, I would love for you to stick around. So be sure to hit that subscribe button down below. Give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I will see y'all in my next one. Bye. Oh,